For the New Zealand sheep industry, AgriSearch's Carla saliva test is a giant leap forward. It shows which animals are naturally more resistant to worms, and it does that without risking productivity. It makes it easier to breed parasite resistant flocks, and this is important because overuse of drench has led to parasite populations becoming resistant to treatment. Until now, breeders have had to look at the number of parasite eggs in faeces to assess how resistant an animal is, and that's very messy, unpleasant, and not very accurate. AgriSearch's Carla saliva test makes detecting parasite resistance in animals much easier. Saliva samples that we take contain antibody to Carla. Carla stands for carbohydrate larval antigen. It's the name we've given to the molecule that we've discovered on the L3 stage of the parasite worms that the sheep pick up off pasture. The uh, animal's just grabbed as if you were drenching the animal. It's essentially no different. And it's a um, matter of just putting the cotton roll attached to the forceps in, into that pouch between the jaw and the cheek. And then just gently um, manipulating the cotton roll for about 7 to 10 seconds. And that will then give you a cotton roll bit mashed up, but that doesn't matter at all. It's just a matter of putting that into a labelled vial and then put into uh, the chiller bag, frozen overnight before sending to the lab. Uh, once we get the samples, we need to remove the saliva from the cotton roll, so we do that by centrifuging the cotton roll. We then assay the samples in a ELISA, which is a standard technique for measuring antibodies to a reagent and that ELISA results in a colour reaction which we read in a machine and from that we can determine the levels of colour antibody. Uh, once an animal is producing a colour response, its response will change relative to the amount of parasite challenge it's picking up off pasture. Uh, early in the season, say February, March, when parasite challenge is not necessarily that high on pasture, the uh, animal that's producing the colour response might average three, four, five units. But once you get to May, June, when the pasture challenge is peaking, that same animal could, could be giving you a reading of 25, 30, maybe up to 50 units per mil. The Carla saliva test is already in big demand. AgriSearch has processed more than 8,000 saliva samples sent by sheep breeders this year. The test is an example of great science delivering real value to New Zealand farmers.